welcome to the vlog i don't know why i'm so chipper today because it's been a morning <laughs> welcome to the vlog it's day 12 it's a great day it's a beautiful day i'm out and about and i wanted to open up the vlog so oh man i need to run back upstairs i i keep forgetting these letters these cards i'm mailing out i'm gonna run back up and get them real quick and before i go i'm gonna go to the p.o box this morning i'm gonna go do some errands but i want to say welcome it's Jess here with Bless Jess. This is Vlogmas Day 12, I believe. And we're getting started with our day. Um, Dave and I have been doing some paperwork and stuff for insurance. It's just been a hot mess of a morning. It's 10 o'clock now, and I feel like we just wasted two hours doing all that. But um, we're done, and I'm headed to the P.O. Box. I need to mail my Christmas cards, and I have a few packages that are there um, that I've ordered online. I've been shipping everything to the P.O. Box. So our apartment, the mail here not so good. <laughs> we have so many issues with it that I just transferred everything to the P.O. Box. Since I'm there anyway, checking for cards from you guys and stuff, it just makes more sense to just get everything there. And then I'm working on my tablescape today. So you guys know I told you that we, you know, uh, I think I told you last night that I sent David after a wreath. I Maybe I told you. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember what I told you. Basically, you guys had some great ideas. I think I'm going to try to get a wreath, and they have them at Sam's, um, these live wreaths that I'm going to use as a centerpiece. However, our Sam's, there was some mix-up, and they show 160 in stock, but there's they're not there. <laughs> so I'm going to go back and just see if it's got straightened out. There's no other Sam's close to us. It's not like an hour drive or 45 minute drive. I don't want to do that. So if I can't find that, I'm going to get just a regular fake wreath and do kind of a similar thing. But I really want the live one for only $16 and I can hang it on my door. So I'm going to kind of work on that. I also want to look around at Sam's for a couple of gifts that I still need to buy. And I need to get some more protein shakes. I used the last one this morning for David's lunch. So that's kind of the plan for today. Kids are in school. We have church tonight. Non-skill victory, though, you guys. Um, Wednesdays are usually the day we weigh in. And I forgot to check with David on how he, how he was doing. I It's just, like I said, it's been a day. But... The scale for me has not moved in a few weeks. It's pretty much hanging right out where it was, <laughs> right at 15 pounds lost. However, I am wearing clothes that I haven't been able to wear in a very long time or ever. Okay, so non-scale victory. This shirt, now it is a little bit tight. I'm wearing a sweater over it because it's so cold. I should have put a jacket on. This shirt says blessed and it has an arrow. When I ordered this shirt, you guys, it would not even... <laughs> <laughs> go on, let alone look, look, let alone look acceptable to wear in public. And today it's a little snug, but it actually fits and it looks okay. And so I'm wearing it blessed and I'm so excited with keto. Like I've noticed that the scale does not show everything. I can tell a huge difference in how my clothes are fitting and how I look on the camera and it's really, really exciting. Even during the holidays, I'm staying on track. So very, very proud of myself. I wanted to share that non-scale victory, which, you know, the non-scale victories are what matter, you know. Um, for breakfast, I had some coffee and I did have my green smoothie today. I really missed that yesterday. So it's just, I've had a lot of questions on how I make it. So here it is again. If you've already heard it, I'm sorry. I take a scoop of protein powder, whatever kind you like, um, and then you put some water in there. I do about two cups, a handful of spinach, as much as you want. I do a real big handful, a tablespoon of almond butter, and a tablespoon of flax, ground flax seed. And I blend it all up, and sometimes I use sweetener and sometimes I don't. It's not real, real sweet, so if you want it a little sweeter, use sweetener. Um, and it's really, really good. I mean, I just kind of chug it <laughs> and it makes me feel really good. It does. It fills me up. It makes me feel good. And I love, I'm loving it. So I had that this morning, but I'm going to run into the PO box. I'm going to run upstairs and get the cards and then go to the PO box and then go to Sam's. Kind of want to go to Hobby Lobby. I kind of want to go to TJ Maxx and I don't have very long before <laughs> this is going to be the day is over. So We'll see how much I can get done, but I wanted to say welcome to the vlog. Welcome to our crazy, busy life, but it's fun and, you know, I wouldn't trade it for anything. So let me get going. You guys, it's a good thing I came to the P.O. Box because 
whoops, just dropped my lens cap. Uh, there was a lot of stuff. It was quite hilarious watching me walk out with all of this. <sighs> okay, so some stuff is coming up for a give giveaway. I may be telling you about that soon. Some stuff is Christmas presents. Um, I ordered some bras online. Maybe that's TMI, but I needed some new ones. Giveaway stuff. I think this is Christmas. Um, so lots of cool things. And then I did get a Christmas card from Gidget. Thank you so much for that. I can't wait to open it. So I'm going to head to Sam's now. Hey, you guys, the lighting's right, real bad right here. Hopefully the camera will adjust. I just wanted to update you guys. I went to Sam's. I'm across town from home and I am hungry. It's right at noon. I thought I could wait till I got home, but I still need to go to a couple more places. So I was trying to decide what to do for lunch. And I don't know, this is probably not the best. I mean, it's going to be low carb, but it's probably not going to be super filling. Um, Wendy's had a huge line, and I'm just in a hurry. So I ran into Racetrack. I got a Coke Zero Cherry. I don't know why. It just sounded good. And then they had cheeseburgers. Just a little tiny cheeseburger. I'm going to pull the bread off and just eat the meat. But um, that's all I could find. I wanted something hot. And, I, oh, man, some of the things, like, I don't know. This is stupid, but I was looking at all that. Um, hot dogs and the little taquitos. I was like, those look so good. And then I'll get it because I can't eat a hot dog without bun. I have to have a bun, but I can't eat a cheeseburger with no bun. So I'm going to do that. I went to Sam's. I, all I got was some protein shakes. They did not have my wreath. I got protein shakes. I found Nate Surtech that we've been buying at Walmart. I don't know why I didn't think to buy it at Sam's because it's so much cheaper. It was $10 for two huge things of it. So I got some more Zyrtec, and then I got Lucy a couple things for Christmas, some little outfits. So stay tuned. I will be doing a What I Got My Kids for Christmas video soon once I get everything together. But right now, I'm headed to TJ Maxx and Hobby Lobby, and then it's going to be time to get the kids. So I just wanted to update you guys on this delicious racetrack lunch. Okay, you guys, super rough draft. I came in. I put all of the presents away so the kids don't see them. And I kind of just played around with this. So I got this wreath for like $12 at Hobby Lobby. I still need to fluff it and everything. I added some pine cones that I had around. Um, and then I got these little picks. <coughs> wow. All the scents in here are getting to me. And then I put these candles on a little cake plate um, that has a little chip out of. I just realized. Um, but I tried to glue it. Anyway, hopefully it's not too noticeable. And then candles. We're going to have ornaments and some votives too. But this is like the main table piece, centerpiece. I'm I'm still texting back and forth with my mom to see what I'm doing wrong or if this looks okay. But um, this is the plates again. So all the plates will be like that. I feel like this goes really well. All the colors. Um, and I kind of liked that I found these little bronze berries because that's on there. I didn't even realize it. I just thought they looked pretty. So that's kind of how it's looking. This whole thing is a work in progress. You will see the final table on December um, 16th or whatever, but what do y'all think? What else should I do? I'm thinking it looks pretty good. And then what I'm going to do is I had to spend a little bit of money to buy this stuff, but I don't have a wreath on my door for Christmas and I've been wanting one. So I'm just going to put this on my door and then I can use it as a table centerpiece or I can use it um, on my door as a front door wreath, and it's really, really pretty. So Hobby Lobby is super picked over. I wanted to get some ribbon. Um, I checked at Sam's, and all the ribbon they had left, which is the best place to buy it, is Sam's because you can get a whole big roll for $6. All the rolls they had left were just weird colors and stuff. So then I checked Hobby Lobby for ribbon because I thought it'd be pretty to maybe put some ribbon around the candles or around the cake plate, or I'm not sure. Um, and they did not have hardly any more ribbon there either everybody bought it up so early I should have done that too but oh man we just crossed into December you know anyway I've got to go get the kids I literally came inside for 10 minutes and kind of played around with this and now I'm gonna go get the kids so let me guys know let me know what you guys think I think it's coming along it's not there yet my friend is getting some glass um, ornaments so we're gonna put around and I also have bought four of these boat of candles that we're going to put around just to add more light and make it all pretty and for a tablecloth we're trying to get one of the ladies at our church to where she said we could borrow one of her tablecloths but I'm not sure what color she has so we're still working that out but thank you guys so much for your suggestions I feel like it's really coming along 
and it looks nice with the plates, right? Don't mind the mess. It's a big mess in here, y'all. Uh, okay, I'll see you guys back when the kids get home and we're doing something else. Okay, you guys, so we are getting ready for church now. I've got the kids. They had a great day. Lucy's packing. We're not taking a whole backpack of stuff to church. It's too much. Okay. Um, Nate had all happy faces, so that's good. We are probably going to run through the drive-thru and get them dinner. I just... I've been so busy today that we're running out of time for dinner. I needed to get a shower, and that was more important than cooking dinner because I felt disgusting. So I have a shower, a blow dry my hair. I wanted to show you guys a very exciting announcement, and stay tuned. I have an even more exciting announcement tomorrow I'm going to be talking to you guys about and ways you can help not only our family. Not only our family, but the autism community. So please stay tuned for tomorrow. It's a super huge day for us around here. So, but today I have a giveaway and I am so excited about this. If you guys remember, I did a review of the Clever Fox Planner and a lot of you like them. I'll leave that planner that I have down below. Great deal on Amazon if you need a planner and I love it. I love it so much. I made that. Okay, hold on. Well, they were nice enough to let me give some stuff away. I'm so excited. So they sent me a whole box of their new dotted notebooks. Do you guys see? These are like bullet journals. I would open it and show you, except I don't want to mess up the packaging because I want to mail these to you and it get, get to you without being all wrinkled. We have seven of these to give away. I have a, this is like a salmon orange color. Um, Lucy's favorite. Probably mine too. The pink. And purple is my favorite. We also have a purple. It's my favorite too. We also, I think this one is so cute. This lime green. The camera's kind of making them look brighter than they are. Well, they are pretty bright. Blue. That's mommy's favorite. I really teal. like this one. Teal. I like that one too. And a black. classic black. So I have seven of these to give away to you guys. If you have not done looked up bullet journaling, just look up bullet journaling. I am super interested in this. These are very nice hard backed journals. Also, they wanted me to let you guys know. Hold on. They wanted me to let you guys know that these are on sale on Amazon right now. So if you're not lucky enough to win one, they are a great reduced price on Amazon. Um, so how I think I'm going to do this is I'm going to give one journal away a day and some of them may be coming with little bonus treats if I can if I can find some stuff around here to give away I think I have a few things so. some might just be the journal some may be giveaway bonuses surprises so if you want to enter I'll be doing this from today all the way through next week till I give away all seven Lucy which one should we give away first uh, which one is she gonna pick I'll let her choose every day which one okay so Lucy Pink that's the one we're giving away for today. So if you want to win this journal, all you have to do is be a subscriber. Um, I'm really trying to give back to my subbies because they give me so much. So I want you guys to, if you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button and then you can enter. Um, and then just leave me a comment down below and let me know. What should we ask them, Lucy? I love you. That's not a question. <laughs> just just leave any comment down below and you will be that you can say like you want to win just tell me you want to win and leave a comment about today's video and you will be entered and I am gonna pick tomorrow so you only have 24 no, hours this is gonna pick tomorrow we only, you only have 24 hours before I'm gonna announce um, Mom, the winner and I will announce it on the vlog at the end of the day and you have to contact me Goodbye. through email that's how we're going to do this. And I hope you can hear me because it's very loud in here. Um, okay, so put them all. Okay, don't ruin the surprise. Put them all back in the box for me. The pink one we're giving away. So you, all you have to do is be a subscriber. Say you want to enter and leave a comment down below. I'll the pink one out. I'll just keep the pink one out. Okay. Um, anyway, so we're headed. I'll let you put this in the box. We are headed to church. Um, I'm very tired, y'all. I'm very, very tired. My back hurts. Uh, tomorrow, I think I'm just going to focus on cleaning the house. You guys know I've been trying to work in blocks. Today's block was getting the uh, wreath done for the table, which I'm very happy with how it turned out. I showed my friend. I showed my mom. They both loved it. So, yay, that's done. Um, and I got a couple more Christmas no. presents today while I was out shopping. Keep it out. Okay. Just to keep out the pink one. Um, 
so tomorrow I think the block the block of of task <laughs> the block task I'm gonna work on is the house because I feel a little bit discombobulated so anyway we are gonna run to church and then when we get no, home uh, first we're gonna go around by Wendy's and then we're gonna go to church and then when we get home from church I will end the video out I hope you guys are having a great day today and um, when you guys are watching it it's Friday so score although we have a super busy weekend so the weekend's not going to be restful at all. <laughs> That's just how it goes this time of year, right? So, again, stay tuned for tomorrow. Super huge opportunity for everyone involved to help spread autism Mommy awareness. Oh, don't ruin the surprise. Okay, we'll see you guys back in a little while. We're home from church. It went really good. We had like 12 youth, which is awesome because we've had a lot of low numbers since like it started getting so dark and holiday season and all that so we had a great time i just got nate down dave is on his way home I'm getting Mommy, interrupted by lucy I let me finish this, talking I, I need to make you a bad time squad for you okay time. how was church good okay i want you to put your jammies on um nate's down but he's not asleep <laughs> it's nine o'clock trying to get lucy down nate go lay down please um dave is on his way home and the house looks like a tornado has ripped through it. Anyway, I just wanted to end out the vlog. I'm going to have to go deal with kids who are getting out of bed. Wednesday is getting them to bed because normally they're, they're in bed at 8. And Wednesdays it's like 9 or 9.30. So I'm going to go deal with that. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Miss Bossy Pants is going to tell him what to do. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this vlog. I don't know exactly what I even got footage-wise, but my day was complete craziness from start to finish. Just really, really busy. So, okay, put your clothes on. If you like this video and you know what to do, make sure you give it a super big thumbs up. Leave us a comment down below that you want to enter our giveaway, and we will be picking tomorrow. Okay. Okay, you did a deal. Please subscribe if you're new. We'll see you guys all tomorrow. Bye.